Hey everyone, it's me, Edward, coming live from a sunny location. Hi, Serena Hammy. How's life? Hey everyone. How's everyone getting on? Hello to everyone who's joined. It's Edward here, live, chilling, vibing in the na- nature of Ireland. As you can see, there's a lot of flowers. I'm currently risking my life getting sunburned, this bald head of myself. I'm currently among flowers. But I would like to be here, but then I'm just way too overcast, but maybe I could be here. Hello. <laughs> it's so sunny. But um, hi everyone, I hope you're all getting a great day. It's a really nice weekend here in Ireland. The weather forecast this weekend Bright spells with great wind. The North Atlantic drift blowing on all of us with hot air. It's looking fresh. It's looking hot. Get your shorts on. Get your legs out. It's going to be a flawless, jepic weekend. Do, 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 do. Guys, I'm currently doing a stretch for all of you. But um, thanks for all joining. Um, how's everyone doing? What Any plans? Um, hi, Sarah. Hi, Zach. Hi, Abby. Hello, Richard, hello Katie, hello Ava Grace. Jesus. Beautiful, beautiful people. Um, yeah, my morning, uh, we ran out of, me and John, we ran out of our sachets of this like powder coffee. And it's like, we have like a gingerbread one, we have like a mocha one. So it's just been tea. So I went to the shop and got myself a nice fancy mocha. Nice and fluffy. I, I just, I like any drink that's fluffy. Like I feel like sometimes if you pay for a coffee and it's not vibing, it's like, what is this? But um, yeah, I'm gonna stop petting my hair. Um, yes, just been out for a nice walk. Yes, congratulations. You're so hot, Edward. No, I'm not. I'm just normal. We're all normal. But um, we made some videos, me and John. So that's why I'm looking a bit flawless right now. I shaved super smooth but um it's been a very eventful week last few days um oh my god breaking news guys we're gonna be putting up a new song today on our instagram and maybe twitter who knows uh it's called treat me like a human and uh, we worked on the song recently um but um it's gonna be off our new album but it's not like a single it's just more just like just like an inspirational song just for you guys but it's not the full song it's like nearly a minute but you guys get the idea it's the pre-chorus and the chorus and then um, the verses are really meaningful but they're not on right now but it's just nice to have some music to vibe to you know sometimes I feel like you put an album and it's too much to take in the whole entire album but it's nice just to kind of be in a moment of now and have this song to kind of just vibe with but um yeah, originally we were going to be like, oh, let's call it Human. But then a lot of people do have songs called Human. But um, it's called Treat Me Like Human. Because sometimes people forget that me and John are not aliens, not UFOs. That um, we're all the same. That we've all gone through the same experiences in Ireland, in school. You know, just so much different things. But, um, oh my God, we had a meeting two days ago about a new TV show. But I can't talk to you guys about it. But, um... It's still all being confirmed, but it's a new TV format and um, it's meant to be filming this summer and then meant to be on air in September. But um, it's kind of crazy because um, we haven't really done Irish TV in a while, but like with the pandemic and stuff, we're not really able to leave to go do other things. But I think it's good to kind of be seen in HD and hopefully we'll get some gel, get some volume going. But, um, Thanks for all your comments. Like we do see all your comments. I will reply and check them out. But um, yeah, I just think me and my underwear, I just really was not planning it. I was just on the beach. I was vibing. I had a song called Waterline, if you don't know. And I was just like, ah, fuck it. Let's get out there. Let's refresh those legs with some nice salt water. But um, um, yeah, I hope you're all staying safe. What's everyone doing? Um, love the song title. Thank you. Hey from Melbourne, Australia. I just never forget us going to Australia. We never even had a song on the radio, but we were doing an Australian tour. We we're on all the different TV shows. But it's kind of nice when people just take you for you 
and it's not all about record sales and followers and all these different types of things that people just are just like oh who are these guys they're kind of cool you know sometimes I feel like it's just you as a person says it all and I feel me and John we've always been the underdogs always the unknowns or not the number one hit but we have had number one hits in our native land Ireland love you guys and like success in different countries as well but I feel sometimes it's better just to be a new flavour a new formula and um, yeah I do think it's good that it's been nearly 12 years and I'm still here rocking it you know my voice is still the same I haven't instantly just turned into someone else but um, thanks for always appreciating us and letting us into your life um, Lucy's here she said are you feeling enlightened Lucy's a fan from London she once sent us a card and it was all about being enlightened and stuff but still to this day I do not know what they're talking about but I kind of do it's all about this luminous vibes um, Edward please say hi to Aoife and Alana hi Aoife and Alana um, you are out of this world thank you to all the new people like I'm kind of getting to know all of you because I feel like it takes a while to kind of get to know your faces but it's nice to just be familiar when I see like different people tweeting us or like it's not just a once off but um, there definitely is a whole new generation of people who aren't even born or maybe we were like still really really young when we did um, Eurovision and stuff so it's kind of crazy that it's going to be Eurovision this soon and like um, and like a lot of stuff's happening in the entertainment world but then um, there's not so much happening that there could be but I think it's nice to just find it within yourself to be creative put yourself out there you know But um, I did my perfect Instagrammer story yesterday. Um, it was absolutely amazing. It was absolutely, it was absolutely flawless. Um, okay, I'm gonna read your comments because you're all here to join this party. If you can share this, that would be great. I'm so that be I really appreciate it. You know. Um, I love you guys. Thank you. Um, isn't it crazy that people don't know you've done your vision? Yes, twice. Um, Melissa goes 12 years past, still going strong. Thank you. It has been 12 years. Sometimes I forget. Um, Bethany. Oh, thanks, Bethany. Um, Cloda, can you say hi to Gronya? Hello, Gronya. Very grown name there. Gronya. I'm going to get into the shade because I feel like I'm vibing, you know, getting this normal light. Okay, I'm risking my life, guys. Yesterday I was filming those videos and I nearly, um, I got a fish hook on my ass because like the area I was in was where all the fisher people do be doing fishing and um I watched that documentary I was watching like Lean Payne talking about that Seaspiracy documentary and then I checked it out and it's kind of crazy all the dolphins and like them doing all the crazy things to the dolphins and killing them and stuff and I feel like I know back in the day me and John we went to like Orlando and stuff and I just feel like it's crazy all this was happening you know but um don't stress just do you Edward thanks Martina it does not feel like 12 years yeah 100% like it's crazy it's crazy to think that it's been 10 years since we did Eurovision like it's insane I don't think it's been the same I know, like that reeling in the years didn't have us on but like Jesus Christ like come on I know I don't really care anyway but it's their loss but um I think it's it's just crazy like and even the last episode like they had all this ice like dropped like some ice ice baby in there you know but um it's meant to be on tonight and they probably won't have us on again because we're just whatever I'm looking very blown out but you know me oh 10 years since CBB as well oh my god yeah it was crazy year 2011 um oh thanks for all the comments you're all legends um Anyway, um, let's see what's happening. There's the sun, there's the sky. I'm really good sick now, I'm really proud of myself. No, no, no. Hmm. Oh, Jesus, this is flying me. Um, so, um, who wants to go live? Or do I need to go live? Well, I'll have to bang through them, because might be bad signal. Hello. What's happening? That's it. Bye. 
Hello. Okay, Sherry is here. Hi, Sherry. Sherry, how is your whole thing happening in... I remember Sherry telling me about the coronavirus and COVID and all that stuff happening in China before it was even a thing here. And I didn't really understand the full situation. But like, it's just crazy that it was like this thing and no one was taken serious. And um, it's crazy to see all those riots as well in London yesterday. And like, the thing about the UK is that they've already kind of come out of lockdown to like, have their shops, have their restaurants, have their bars. And then there's these people just, like, I don't even know what's happening. Anyway, um, oh my God, I think I'm in really, really hardcore grass right now. Like really like, oh my God, it's gonna cut me monster eating grass. Like it's full on grass. Um, oh my god, we're all here. We're all vibing. Uh, I don't know why my phone doesn't work. Is it working? Hello? Debbie, are you there? We don't know, but anyone else watching, I hope you are all staying safe. Yes, you own 2011. Edward, your mother would be so proud. Thank you. Uh, um, I love the song Lipstick. Yes, Lipstick is definitely a vibe. It's so crazy that we had a song called Lipstick. I remember it was like the other way around. It was all like, I got my lipstick on. And then we changed it to She's Got Her Lipstick On. Anyway. Um, da -da -da, there's my shoes. La 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 la. Oh my God, who is he? Who is he? I gotta pull my pants up. Hey everyone, what's up? It's Edward. Shut it. But my underwear, they're pink. Mm. I feel like one of those people who are like doing a little photo shoot. It is a nice day. I feel like, like I'm doing a bit of um choreography here. <laughs> Going into the tough grass just for you guys. We're chilling. We're all chilling together. We're rolling in the grass. Oh my god! So it's killing me. It's so hot right now. Oh jazz, it's so hot. We're turning together. Getting that vitamin D. Oh my god, my back. Anyway, I don't know if I'm getting old or I'm just getting back problems, but Jesus Christ, my my back was sore for a while. But then I realised that, um, you know when you're on the bus or like the dart or somewhere like that, and I was sitting the wrong way, cause sometimes I'm hunched over, that could give you back pain. So just always make sure to sit correctly when you're travelling in a car or somewhere. Anyway. Um, they're all legends. Everybody's looking for that something. Oh. Uh. Hello. Hi, Stephen Rooney. Hello. Looking <clears throat> great. Oh my God. You know what I mean? Great. Look at your hair. Wow. Mm -hmm. Do you think we would have ever seen the day that you had more hair than us? <laughs> I know. Were well, you out in the sun? You're looking very uh, sun-kissed, ready for that. Yeah, I was out in the sun all yesterday. Are you still in Liverpool? Yeah. Mm. Are you still like the manager? <laughs> <laughs> when was the last time we saw you? Um, was it when you come to switch the lights on in Liverpool? Okay. And like, you used to have your sh you used to have the shaved hair look, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Don't worry about me. I'm concealed into an inch of my life while I was making videos, but um, yeah. it's all good. Like you've swapped hair. What? I said it looks like you've swapped hair. And you still have your Jabber tattoo. Congratulations. So proud of you. Of course. Oh, and you got your nice fluffy couch there. Is that, is that a leather couch? Yeah. <gasps> Very fancy. Do you, do you want to see me dog? Yeah. Your dog. Let's see your dog. Come on. Oh. My doggy oh, he's, Edward. He's out the window there somewhere. What type? Oh my God, a little chihuahua, a little blaze. Do you? Come on, lad. Yeah. No. No. 
Quick. Just say hello, little Blaze. Oh, he's looking out the window. What's his name? Duke. Duke. Stephen, you're always like our like our first to kind of um, like we're in a, a month so all these screaming girls and you were there rocking it, representing the guys. Yeah. Loads. I always <laughs> appreciate it. Keeping us safe, you know, in case any crazy people came, you're ready to beat the shit out of them, weren't you? Always ready. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? When's the time you were in Ireland? Do you know what? I haven't been over for ages. Sarah and Ashley have been to come and like stay in man for a bit, but like what? Sarah and Ashley have been coming to stay over in Man in Liverpool. Oh, that's but good. It's good they haven't been for like a year. <laughs> you, is there any other you? Do, do, I remember? I don't know. It's just so funny. It's, it feels like ages ago. I feel like I'm going back to college years. Mm. But um, it's all fun. You're, you're still friends, Sarah and Ashley. Yeah, yeah. Still do that. I'll speak to them all the time. Someone just commented saying, "Do I live with Tara Reid? No, I have my own place and always chilling, just like Stephen. We all got our lives together. But um, I'm currently on the sun burning." Getting really hot right now. Are you no, I'm gonna, to I'm today? gonna go out in the minute in the sun. Yeah, walk Duke the dog. I know. Me too. Stephen, I'm I'm st have I aged? Like am I still vibing? No, you haven't aged a bit. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Anything else you wanna say? <laughs> <laughs> Jared OG fans reunion. You've got, you've got all your people. Do you not think it's crazy that loads of people know you? I know, definitely. Good. Were well, you on a documentary? You're on a documentary, weren't you? At the Jerry Jever Tattoo. You're on something, remember? Yeah, was it, was it Jared Let Loose? Jesus, Jared Let Loose. I remember that? Jared Let Loose was having to go to this house and make out that we lived there. <laughs> <laughs> I remember Very sitting outside broke. the house. What? I said, I remember sitting outside the house. Do you, I just remember everything fucking breaking. They built this development and nothing was basically ready. And we were just happily walking and the door, top of a door would be falling off. And I'd always think like, do the people living there now know that we lived there? Anyway, it's all good. We're going to be doing um, other shows. It's, but don't worry. We'll Any updates on when the tour is going to be? Uh, either April or May. It's kind of weird because, uh, or June, it's sometime there. But I just feel like... Um, different weekends aren't available and then I was thinking of doing Easter but then I think flights and hotels would be hard to get for everyone yeah. mm. like and then I was thinking bank holidays but then they're always so busy it's like I don't know it's all just crazy and then the, the, the May last time it just I don't think the Glasgow date is available that Sunday it's all just fucking mad but at least it's still happening yeah it's a, I didn't cancel it still doing it always and then we and then we have um, we'll have probably have a new album out by then so we'll just have fucking like 40 new songs to perform. It's going to be a long show. Fun. What? I said, that'll be a long show. It'll be such a long show. Three hours. Getting our money's worth. I need to brush my teeth. I had like this crazy coffee. Demon, I'll let you be. What? Stay safe. Stay epic. Peace out. Bye, Stephen Rooney. See you later. I will. <laughs> You guys don't know that Stephen Rooney, an OG Jedward fan from back in the day, still here vibing, still here joining Edward for the lives. Anyway, I always love it like when fans in the UK know fans in Ireland or fans from Germany, and he's always can fly to each other's house and just vibe. So it's always good. Um, such a cute dog. Yeah, it's kind of cool that he has a dog that looks like our dog Blaze. Um. Oh yeah, I'll have to definitely have to put my factor fifty on. I had a moisturizer. I think it's factor thirty, but um, yeah. Last night I put a mask on, and um, I also washed my face. So congratulations to me. Um, who else is on this? Thoughts on Gary Barlow? Well, he is a Jared tribute act. He did have our hair for a while, so congratulations to him. Um, sing bad behavior? No, no, I will not. Um, oh, Orly's here. Hi, Orly. Haven't seen Orly in a while, but I remember she's always checking in, saying hi. Um, hey, everyone else. We have Ellie. What's your thoughts on Rock DJ by Rod Williams? Well, we sang it on X Factor. It was our first song we were doing on the show. I don't know why we're coming from the ceiling and they went into a close-up shot. We never actually got to see us flying in like cool people. Um, oh my god we're going live to Sweden Trace 
crazy there. To all hundred people watching, you're all Jeffic legends. We love you so much. You're all incredible. We love you. We appreciate you. Therese, come on. Don't have all day. No. Nope. Going once. Going twice. Going three times. Hello? Hello, hello? Oh. Um. Ah. Uh, no, 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 no. Um. Oh, my God. I'm currently looking at a really epic view. Like, it looks so nice. It's so vibey. Um. Show my jacket. This is a jacket John got. It's like a Tommy Hilfiger jacket, but we just got it because it was a good deal. We're not like, oh my God, look at me. I'm wearing Tommy Hilfiger. Um, hello. Oh. Are there any UK tour, tour plans? Yes. We're doing dates next year. Um, do we still see Ed Sheeran? Well, we saw him before the whole pandemic and stuff. And we saw contact. Um, please sing Lipstick. I don't want to sing lipstick because it's like the national anthem of Ireland and people might know that there's a Jebwood nearby. Um, yeah, it's always good to talk to everyone, catch up. This girl's been a fan since the womb. Congratulations. Like that must be true because sometimes we do have pregnant people at our, at our um, concerts and that baby hasn't even been born and they're literally rocking out in a Jebwood concert before they even do anything in their lives. So I do believe that person was a Jebwood fan since the womb. So congratulations. Um, I've been a fan since I was six. Oh my God, thank you, Mac Cranfly. You legend. Everybody. Who are, I don't even know half these people. Um, hello? It's so weird because I feel like when I go live with people, it's like I'm doing an interview and I'm just like not even in the mindset to even think about what's happening with people you know and then like I don't even know like where these people like you know like it's all crazy there's a person here with like Michael D Higgins but clearly it's not Michael D Higgins so that's kind of stressful um oh my god um oh I don't even know who I picked there hello I think I'm on another. Oh, hi, Trey. It's looking great. How are you? I can't hear you. Something. I can hear you. No, I can hear you. I can hear you. Great. Well, great. Where are you? You're outside. You look great. I, I'm um, washing my car. Incredible. Get wet. Get fluffy. Get those bubbles going. We all want to watch. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. That's so good. I haven't washed a car in ages. I remember I used to wash my granddad's tractor and cars back in the day but i haven't really got around to it yeah i'm not watching my car myself there's a company that does it for me oh congratulations i always feel i remember this carl's jr advert where there's these girls and they eat a burger and they're washing a car i remember the car wants to do that i was like if you want to do that how much yeah. do you charge to wash your car what you need to drive us around your car someday yeah yeah absolutely did you shave the side of your hair it's all grown back no not really i have it in a in a hair tie. It's looking great. I'm so jealous. I see literally people with hair and I'm just like, give it to me. Oh, really? Give me some hair side chats. <laughs> it's exactly so weird. You look good right now with the hair you I got. I swear. It's so carefree. You know how it feels. Just wake up and just not have hair to style or even flicker. I find myself having to hide it like in a cap, but usually I have nothing to hide. Like I'm just like, hey. So it's all good. But then yeah, the but sides, I... I might quote the sides because they're it's too blonde. I look like a an albino UFO. Well, I like the new look. It looks good. Oh, thanks. I'm happy it's doing it for you. Looks great. Oh, so thanks. how are you doing? I don't know. I'm doing okay. Like, um, I think we just need to focus on what we're doing. Like, we had it, I, well, I already said, like, we had a meeting about this new TV show and it's meant to be filming in June. So we just need to get our outfits and stuff ready for that. Yeah. And, we didn't have some interview requests, but then we didn't really feel like we need to do them all because we already kind of already said, you know, like, I don't want to get too deep into different things because, like, sometimes it's not, I don't know, like, I don't really feel it's the time. 
I, I don't really want everyone to focus on these different types of things, but I'd rather be about the music, you know? Yeah. I'm going to start tweeting a picture of my ass, but uh, that was good. <laughs> We'll need to do that. I was just like, ah, fuck it, why not? And then I was just like, oh no, I'm not really ready for my ass in the world. No, exactly. And then I was thinking about maybe like, getting a more HD campaign. Like, you know, Peter, like, I'd rather wear be naked than wear fur. Really? I'm not, they asked us to do it a while ago, so who knows? I'll be getting ready for my Peter campaign. Uh, yeah, you do that. I've already messed it. I've already messed it. But then I was like, you know, we've been big, big, big brother and we're running around in our underwear and John had a thong on and big brother, like, what's the big deal? Yeah, what's the big deal? Like, I know, that, but like some people are cool. just, like sending me crazy stuff. But I, maybe I just give people warning, you know, get like the blur effect. Well, you're going out there being yourself and that's great. Thanks, so, Trip. Just do, do your thing. I will. <laughs> John's he's recording some songs today. Really? Some Elvis song. He's recording um that song Falling in Love. Aww. I kind of like to hear that. Oh, I don't know. He's always really emotional about doing these songs. He's like such a perfectionist. Like sometimes I'm like, You did it good and then he's like, No, you do it again. I'm like, Oh Jesus, let's keep going. Ah, he's doing great. No, I know he is. Like I know I need to do covers with him and stuff, but it's all well, fine. Well you should join him. You should really join I'm him. So you should great. I know, thanks for this therapy. <laughs> I will. I were meant to be doing Shane O'Connor, another comparison to you, but like, I, I, oh. I even bought Polonex. I bought Polonex online and it took like a week and a bit to Yeah, buy they it. just told me my car is, is, is done. I need to pay. Oh, yeah, you get on with your life. Yeah, talk to you later, okay? Jesus, she's hanging up on me. No, okay. I'm not hanging Good up life, on Trace. you. Good life, Trace. I love you, Trace. Thanks so much. I love you. Bye bye. Oh, that's Trace getting on with her life. She's washing her car. Come on, guys. We're now below 100 fo- viewers. This is really tragic. Come on. We need to get that up there. Um, ring me. I'm cleaning my car. Another person's cleaning their car. Congratulations. I'm so excited for you. Um, hey, guys. Welcome to the Edward call line. I'll be chilling with you today. Hopefully the signal's good. Edward, you're so cool. Your lives. Oh, no problem. Thanks, Grania Garvey. Do you like pineapple on pizza? You know, I'm really not the type of person who really cares. I'll have pineapple, then I won't have pineapple. I feel a lot of things happen. I feel there's a lot of concoctions and food that could work, but just people never did them. Um, oh, you're perfect. No, you're perfect. We are perfect. Perfection. I'm gonna go back into the sun, the shade. Ooh, moody vibes. Remember when you broke your leg on T4 on the beach? Yes, I will never forget it because it's a day that's really affected my life on my leg. Um, yeah, you two are great. Thanks, Jimbo. Hello, everybody. How's life? Anyway, I should probably let you all get back to um, bits and bobs. Emma Boo's here. Hello, Emma. How's life? I hope you're doing fabulous. It's really lovely, lovely day for a lovely picnic and ham and scones and a beautiful jam sandwich. I think I'll treat myself to a cucumber sandwich. Anyway, oh wow, we've got a lot of people joining us. We've got Anne Sophie Louise, we've got Helena, we've got Evie Gishburn, we've got Lucy, we've got Belinda, we've got Emily. We've got Debbie, we've got Lily, Lindsay, Abby, and Amy Fagan. Fagan. But I hope you're all doing incredible. Oh, Jesus, we're going to go to the most shepherd girl of the land, Martina Brown. Martina? Hello? Martina? Pose, you know. Oh yes. <laughs> Hello. Oh Jesus! Never thought I'd see the day. Mm. You are my fire, 
the one. I'm just not in a position to sing right now, you know. Got you my vocal warm-ups. Anyway, I hope everyone has a great day. And um, make sure to stay tuned to our Instagram for Treat Me Like a Human. I'm still here. Getting all those angles, you know me. Risking my life. I could be getting stung by dettles or whatever they're called, nettles. I'm back up. Anyway, I think I need to put my cap on, you know, being famous enough. vibing hi molly molly i checked out your singing you're really vibing i think i got stung by nettles i'm feeling some kind of traction happening on my ass around my lower back anyway um the locals clearly know i'm here around but um we're walking we're talking we're vibing um it must be way easier to push. Yeah, definitely way easier. Okay. I'm going to go here now. Seems like it's good shade. There's lovely shade. Are we? No, that's okay. That's okay. Oh, wow. Look at me. Okay, we're here. Edward, can you please say hi to Ray? Hi, Ray. Um, yeah, I will not forget my cat because it's my secret identity. Anyway, we're here chilling. The sun is so harsh, especially with this blonde. It's natural blonde. Oh, this is kind of happening. Okay, we're here. Fine. Okay. Hi, Bradley. Hi, Ellie and Kira. To everyone else sitting there going, Jesus Christ. Edward, what's up? I appreciate all of you as well. You're all legends. Look at this sparkly filter. Hello? Oh, wow. Jesus, not happening. Oh, yeah, that's cool. That's cool, by the way. Hey, bro. Don't have to change when I change. I don't know what this filter's meant to do, but it's kind of happening. Wow, Jesus, I look great. Yeah, I'm loving my filter. Hello. I feel some of these filters need to update. Some of them are not happening. Oh my god, this filter is crazy. <laughs> I can't even. I'm going back to that, whatever that one was with the glasses. It's kind of happening. Oh, it's giving me the leather jacket. Jesus, I look great. Wow. Nah, how did it get all these filters? No filter. Beautiful. Anyway. Um, hi, everyone. To everyone watching, you're all legends. Oh, my God. I can literally see who's watching right now. So I'm going to give you all shout-outs. Hi, Rachel and Nicole. Hi, Jerry. Hi, Rosie. Hi, Sunflower Glazy Queen. Hi, Megan Jones. Hi, Nathan Robinson. Hi, Jepic Shannon. What is up, Evim, Evie? Hi, Fiona, the Grimes Twins 3. Hi, Nesta Gab. Hello, Erica Cody fan page, Martina Byrne. Hello, Shauna Fisher 678. Hello, Lucy Doyle 25. Hey, Gemma Malesh 4, Gemma. Hi Izzy, hi Lucy, hi Sam, hey Mary, hey Tam underscore Jepic, hi Evie Austin, hi Jesse Hiccup, Jepic legend, hi Anna Sophie Louise, hello David J. Williams, what up, hello Alison Hatut, hello Evie King, hello Sarah McGlinchey, great name. Hello, Melanie, who's driven all the way to see us before. 
Hello, me, Garachi, Garachi. Hello, Emma Kearns. How are you? Angela jo- Jofoski. Jofoski. Hello, Shamrock Shelley. Hey, Elizabeth. Lainey, 89. Hey, John Yates. Hello, Christina Healy. Hello. Someone's saying hello to me in the background. Hello? Someone said hello to me. Anyway, that's getting a bit long. But, um, you draw on legends. Everybody's looking for something. Jeez, I'm so cold in the shade. I feel like, I don't even know, like, you're hot, then you're cold, then if you're in the shade for too long, you're so cold. Like, the cold has taken me over. Like, I'm getting really cold. But, um, yeah, everyone stay safe. I don't know how long I've been on this, but, um, we love you. Yes. So, Okay, hi Leah, happy, happy birthday from me and you and Jennifer. Your skin's beautiful. Ah, it's all right, you know. Thanks, Rebecca, I love you too. Anyone else want to say anything? Edward, me and Laura are highly offended. Okay, Summer Burn. Um... Ah, uh, thanks, Gemma. Yeah, we really appreciate you and care about you. Or maybe I should stay live and we should all just go on a walk together. That'd be great. Let's do that. Oh, but who knows? The signals might be hot. I don't know. But um, it's going to be like this, just like walking. To- oh, oh my God, I should put my earphones in. Then we can hear my, my signal. Mm, okay, but then I feel like sometimes like some people might tune in and be like, Jesus, I'm really expecting something. But then um, we're just walking and talking like, can you guys hear me? Hello? Hello? Maybe it might cut off after an hour. Who knows? But, oh, my doing fell. I'm the original OG. Yo, dudes, what's up? Oh my god, it's great lighting here. Yeah, there's good lighting. I've got a bunch of randomers coming my way. I do not know who they are. But, um, you look jacked right now. Thank you, Laura. I really appreciate it. But anyway, where's John? John is doing his cover. Um, tell us a fact about yourself. Jesus, give me a Google, like, there's a lot of facts out there. Um, uh, yeah, can't wait to rock London. Yeah. It's going to be a vibe. I don't know where this path leads to, but hopefully it leads somewhere good. You guys can hear me, yeah? Hello? Can you guys hear me? Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! There's loads of flies and a piece of poo. Oh, oh my God. This is disgusting. Oh, my God. Oh, the blue flies. They're all jamming on a piece of shit. Oh. Anyway, I'm currently walking here. That's my shadow. Anyway, we're walking. We're vibing. It's a really steep hill. Will I make it? Who knows? I think I will. Who knows? I'm going to be falling anyway for you guys. Making my way. The, the broke the mountains of Ireland. But looking like incredible with my white shoes. Look at these shoes. Who is he? Who is he? Who is he? 
Come on, guys. We're actually walking in this together. I feel so proud of us all. Okay, guys. It's getting steep, but I'm doing it for you. Multitasking and vibing. Like, it's really steep, guys. But, you know, these are not the shoes. Like, I, we're doing a, a hike here, guys. We're so LA right now. Hello? We're still into guys. We're getting through this together. I need a mesh of support for me getting through this really hardcore walk. Um, be careful. Yes, I will be careful. Um, <laughs> uh, no, I did not step in poo. Um, it's so lovely out. Yeah, it definitely is. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going on this crazy mountain walk. Well, it's not that crazy. Hello. Sherry from Hong Kong is still watching. Sherry, where are you? Can you go live? I'd love to see what's happening in China. Jesus, I'm literally going to die here. Oh, Jesus. I can't see it. Okay. Over here now, guys. Vibe and chilling. Go, Edo. Be careful. If you fall, please land. Don't hurt yourself. We believe in you. Thank you. Okay. Be careful. We're on here. Do, 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 do. Here's our views. We're chilling. Oh, yeah. I do not do the step situation, but I'm just out here walking. I'm going to try to get down. <gasps> I'm literally going to fall, guys. I'm going to get low. I'm going to get low. Ugh. We're getting low. It's my technique. I feel like if you're, you should always lean backwards. So if you fall, you're going to fall backwards. You're not going to fall forwards. Like on your side, like instead of walking forward, I kind of do the step side action. I don't, I'm not professional, but like, I kind of do this situation where I'm like that and bring it to it. That, bring it to it. Instead of like, that's my technique. And then if I fall, I'm just falling on my ass. Doing Instagram live, you know. We're literally on a virtual walk together. You guys can hear me, yeah? You guys are making it. I'm so proud of us. Okay, one last try. It's not that hardcore, but for me doing Instagram live in my tennis shoes. <gasps> okay, we've got a big one. Okay, we're here. I can hear, I'd love to like get a pair of boots on and vibe through the water. Getting some vitamin D on my hair. Hello. Um, I will be careful. Everyone stop stressing. I'm a professional. I, oh my God. Okay, I'm still walking. I'm still vibing. I'm gonna let some new locals go by. Can you say happy birthday to my best friend, Amelia? Hi, Amelia. I am on flat ground now. I'm on a time academed area. Any more locals coming? No. And the travels continue. I don't know where the stairs leads to, but we might take the stairs. What do you guys think? Stairs or continue up here? I think we need to get to the top of that stairs. Get the steps in those. Stretch. Yes. Gotta get the stretch in. Bend that leg. Yes. Oh, gotta get the stretch. Then it's such a hardcore walk, guys. Ooh, yeah. I'm definitely getting whiffs of pee and poo. Oh my God, it's a dandelion, guys. Let's blow it. Look at that detail. Goodbye. Okay, we're still going up here, guys. I'm hearing accents. I'm hearing, can we take a picture here? Anyway, look at this pole. Like, it's such a, a pole. You just want to get up and start sliding on. Anyway, we're, gonna get, we're on our way to heaven, guys. The heaven, the stairs to heaven. Here we come for all our sins and all our good vibes. 
I just kind of can't kind of picture the granny climbing up here, like little Granny Mary. These nice little bluebell, her little flowers. Yes, there's like, I love all these. Oh, here's a bee. Let's go and risk our lives. Here's a bee, loving life. Hello. There's a bee. Maybe zoom in. Can we zoom in? Hello, Mr. B. Yes, here we are. Getting the National Geographic Channel. Coming live. Hello? Making that honey for us. I'm really proud of myself. Like, literally, I did not know my camera was this vibey. Anyway, goodbye. I'll see you later, yeah? No bother, still get up the stairs to heaven. We're still vibing, guys. If you don't know, it's me, Edward, with my Calvin Klein hat, which I got for like seven euro from TK Maxx. I just heard, I just heard a girl say she wants to make her Instagram huge. Last picture she posted and that's all I heard. God, this is the conversations you hear. I think I'm kind of now in some kind of a state. Well, now they're walking up here now. Anyway, let's make some daisy chains, guys. Slide in the daisies. Um, I'm now in a bush area. Ooh, we are on the grass, guys. It's a daisy. I love the Katy Perry Daisy song. You guys can hear me, yeah? Look how detailed that is. Like, Jesus Christ. Like, come on. Come on, guys. Wow. Did anybody know you could zoom in that detailed? I did not know. Wow. Oh. Anyway, we're back, guys. Mm. Um... Okay, um, you can all hear me, yeah? Oh, your daisy chains. I swear to God, it takes so much skill to make a daisy chain. I don't know how you do it. And they always die, and you're just like, oh, Jesus, like, we've got, like, these, um, I'm like, God, we've got this air trails are coming, guys. The country, the sky, spelling my name. Um, but I'm happy we can all be here together, and I can just talk to myself. But, like, I'm not really talking to myself, because I kind of know you guys. You're my best friends. You're my best friend. You're a real bad bitch. Gotta own money. Oh my god, there's a really nice plant here. I don't know why. I don't think I'm allowed here, but then I am. Oh, there's little birds. Look at this beautiful red tree. Like, Jesus. Look how nice it looks. Such a nice tree. Oh, there's a bee. Oh my god. I need die, guys. Risking my life just for you. Anyway, you know, National Geographic Channel with Edward. I know he got shocked. The signal's good, yeah? Um, yeah. Anyway, you're all legends. Thanks for your comments. But, like, let's look at this bush. Like, literally, it's so nice. It's so nice. Look at this. Wow. First, I just need to acknowledge some of these things. Like, look how nice that is. So nice. So nice. I'm sorry, but like, wow. Hi, Rob. Rob's watching. Hello, Robert. Oh, now I'm going to go in this nice shaded part. Risk my life again. Oh, yeah. I'm loving this backdrop. I wish my face wasn't so crazy. Hey guys, welcome to the um, the artist channel where we get creative with our angles. We love flowers, we love birds, we love just vibing with nature, being one together, you know yourself. Anyway, really appreciate it. Um, yes, I'm so happy you guys love my bush. My bush is really colourful. 
the really colorful blush. Look at that. Super nice. Anyway, I feel like I turned the camera around the other way. The camera on the other side is better, maybe. But I don't know what I look like. Hello? I'm just chilling. But um, I hope you're all doing good. I hope it's like some little granny watching me from her house. I'm just going. One of the Jetworths was here yesterday. He was in a... He was admiring my bush who knows you just never know how it's going to work but um yeah I'm going to flip around again oh wow oh yes but um I'm getting I'm okay signal yeah um Love this one. Yes, we do. It's kind of getting cold. I'm in the shade. Hello. I am not in someone's gaff. This is a public area. I'm pretty sure. I had be. Oh, the signal is great. I'm so happy for that, Brie. Thanks for the confirmation. Um, it's freezing. Oh, my God. Down, down. Compliments the red bush. I would please just say Neve. Hi, Neve. H, F, or. Um, I need to pee really, really bad, guys. Like, I should probably just leave this on. And maybe go pee somewhere. Like, you know, I really need to go. But maybe I might not do that, you know. I never hear the end of the day. Um, it's vibing or something. Hi, Helen. Oh, Hi. Helen, right as well. Helen, I miss yeah. you. Oh, I'm not sure. Um, yeah. we've, we've, married, we've been married for so long now. It's been such a long distance relationship. I'm so happy that we stay in contact. <laughs> Helen, where are you? How are you? I don't know. You're kind of... I, I'm okay. I'm not the best, but like I'm just dealing with everything going on. Staying Same. strong. Same. Are you guys... Are you still able to go like out and about? Is it different in Glasgow? No, we can walk about. Oh, that's good. Are the, are the shops open? Is Primark open? Not Monday. Did you hear about the Aldi range? I really wanted to get like those socks and stuff. You know, everyone's vibing with Aldi right now with the yeah. all the drama. <laughs> Whoever thought we'd see the day where people are like wanting to get Aldi hoodies with like an Aldi logo and stuff. I'll go there on Monday and get one. <laughs> well, well, they're probably all gone. Who knows? But maybe they'll just... I don't know. I, just, I, I can't believe after all these years we still don't have a fucking hair care range. Like, why did no one ever want to get the Jebel hairspray? I don't know. It's tragic. Like, we need justice for the hair. But now I, I probably won't be good doing it ever. For, but I have more brown now than I have blonde. No, you've got blonde. Is no, it's, it's kind of brown. Oh. So, Helen, it's great to see you, like, just looking. In my garden. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. you're in a garden? Yeah. I'm waiting on my friend. We're all going down to the park because my friend passed away three Aww. weeks ago. So, we're all going down there. And did you go to school with her? It's at him. No. Oh. Just met him through a party. <laughs> oh, so you're at parties, living up no. in parties. You know me. I like a party. So that's yeah, so always the life of the there. party. Okay. Yep. And is his family going to be there? Yeah. I'm just setting off balloons. Okay. Well, it's nice that you're going there. You can... Yeah. Show support. What? Yeah, it is show good to show, yeah, it is good to show your specs and be there. Club Austin. And how old is he? He was 28. Wow, that's crazy. I know. That's so insane. Young. I know. I don't really that's have... Cool. I, I know I have my family and friends, but um, it is crazy. Because sometimes, like, even that girl, woman in the Late Late Show, like, I went to late, we went to the Late Late Show and this girl, and we thought she was...
fine. And then next time she wasn't there and we're kind of wondering where she was and she'd passed away. <gasps> but then Ryan, t- remember, she, remember Ryan Tuberty and stuff had, but you just never know. Like some people just look like they're fine and they don't, re- you don't really know. And then yeah. they have all these underlying health conditions. So true. But we're sorry to hear. So short, it? Yeah. Like I, I don't know how many times I've nearly got knocked down. Love your life. Oh, who's your one in the background? Is that your, is that your neighbour? That's my mum. Oh, your mum's looking great. Wow. Looking great in that colour, that coral red. <laughs> She's got a good head, so. Helen, when was the last time you were in Ireland? What? When was the last time you were in Ireland? Four years ago. It's, that's crazy. Like, you were literally here, like, every other few weeks. <laughs> Do you remember we used to always see you like I swear to God like it's crazy it's been four years that's mental four we years. definitely hasn't been, no we've seen you we saw you last tour 100% yeah, yeah. okay that's good yeah. I'll do it I'll, pro- do, I'll do it up to the nines I- with your hair and your makeup and but now yeah. we're all just vibing but you still have all those features you know you're still Helen looking um, flawless so your, <laughs> your incredible volume is hair yeah, but I just want to scream I'll be at the next tour. Yes, thanks, Helen. Really appreciate it. Even if it's just you at the tour, it's going to be all worth it. Well, I don't talk to anybody. Uh, it's okay. You don't need to talk to anyone. As long as you have us, that's all that matters. I'll just scream you. What? Do you have to talk to scream. Debbie? Ah! <laughs> what? No, but I'll be definitely on. So I, I was... I was talking to Stephen Rooney a while ago. Yeah, it cut off when, I, when he came on. Oh, really? Oh, so yeah. it, no, it cut off for everyone? No, it just cut Who off knows? for me. I think. Okay. I don't know. What's your mom's name? Let's go say hi to that he's sexy looking great, bitch. He? Yeah, he, he's looking good, really cool. Her name's Helen. <laughs> Her name's Helen as well. Mom. Yeah. Mom. Mom. Edward wants to say hello. Hi, Helen's Hi. mom. How are you? You're looking great. I like your red. You? I'm fine. You're such a hero. You. You're such I'm a sure. hero. Wow. Uh, I'm, I'm really impressed about your gardening skills. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I was like, okay. who's... Just, just give me a shout. <laughs> I love your accent. Yeah. Helen, you? you never told me your mom was such a ride. <laughs> I'll say looking yeah, great. Yeah. <laughs> He's had the same hair color and all. Yeah. Oh, my family's got ginger hair. No, it's not ginger. It's like a... It's like uh, a, like it's a ginger. Is it? It's, no, it's more of a brownie red. No, it's ginger. Someone said, hi, Helen's mom. I love that everyone's vibe with Helen's mom. She's doing the... <laughs> she's cutting the bushes and everything with the big... What's it called? Head trimmers. Yeah. Is it a hedge trimmers? Yeah. Okay. She does have And Sam's she does here. Have Helen, okay, it was great seeing you. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Mwah. Mwah. See you Thanks, later. Helen. Stay Thanks, safe. Helen. Love you. Thanks, Helen. Love I will. You. Bye. Love you too. That's Helen, the one and only. Oh my God. I can't believe people cut. Did it cut out for people? Yeah, Helen is a legend. Old school legend. Always rocking it, giving us good energy. Um, uh, hi, everyone. Oh my God, my ass is literally burning in the sun right now. Like, it is glorious. Half of me is in the shadows and half of me is in the shade. But it's totally vibrant. I think we need to get up and get on with ourselves. You know, I'm really going to miss this bush. So nice. Look at those vibes. Anyway. We're back on our travels, guys. We don't know where we're going, but all we know is that we're outside getting fresh air. Wow. Got someone looking at me. Anyway, let's get on right. Yeah, Jerry Dream Factory. Where are the top tier days? No, I don't think so. Literally. Every day is a great day. Jedward Voice of Rebel, the best album. Oh, I'm on a dead end. Jesus. Oh, I wasn't going anywhere. Now I'm going to walk this way. I'm so happy the locals could get their vibes on with Jedward. But um, I always feel like, hopefully you guys can hear me, and I've got good signal. (laughs) 
Oh, we're getting more people and more people are joining. How is your knee? Yeah, my knee's doing pretty okay. The swelling seems to have gone down. And then um, I think I'm definitely vibing more. Um, fresh air is nice. Um, Effie Lewin is watching. Um, I signed your CD, Effie. I was pimping it up last night, the CD. Making it extra special, but I need to go buy stamps because um, I need to get that all together to send to all the legends getting their je signed Jared Voice of Rebel CD for the fifth time. <laughs> Only messing with so many people who didn't get it who have now just got it. So that's kind of cool that they have the opportunity to get it. Like I always find like all these different people I don't know who are following you and they ordered the CD and you're like, who is this person? There's like so many guys and girls and those are people just different from around the UK that you know how they know you, but then they see you on different things. So it's nice that they get your music and they want to have the CD. Like, anyway, we're still walking, guys. Getting our vibes on. It's a cute little dog. But, um, how's everyone still in this life? Is that a castle behind you? No, I do not see a castle. But, um, oh, thanks, Sasha. Happy you like your signed CD. I'm burping, sorry. Um, hey, everyone. So glad it's getting close to summer. I kind of feel like it's already getting a bit summery. Someone's asked me about going to the beach. You wish. Seeing me rocking it in my multi-pack underwear. Um, are we still in lockdown? Yeah, we kind of are, but we're allowed to stay within our county. Um... Oh my God, look at this nice neutral light. I feel like I want to plug my phone into a charger because I feel like it's going to die. And I'm really hooked up, guys. Look, I've got my power pack and my charger. And like, you know, I've got to keep that good battery power going for all of you. Because why not? Okay, we're plugging it in, guys. Plugging it in, guys. We're getting our power on. I'm going to take out these earphones. I wish... Mm. Okay, well, I'm seeing a lot of tourists. I love water. I love the sound of water. It's so relaxing. I look like someone who's, like, really into themselves and is talking on the phone. I'm just going to act like I'm talking to my dad or my family member. Hello. It's so beautiful, Mammy here. I love being out in the countryside. Anyway, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I saw this amazing TikTok last night. And um, you know, Ellen Chanted, the movie. They're apparently recording the second Ellen Chanted in Ireland somewhere. And I remember we were looking at different film locations. There's some estate down in Wicklow. It's called Lug Lugali or something. I don't know what it's called, but you can rent the location. It costs a fortune. It's like this old castle, all this type of this, like lake and everything. It's like a private lockdown area and they're meant to be shooting Ella Enchanted I think that's how you say it with Anne Hathaway in Ireland in next month so I'm definitely going to check that out because that's just incredible but um yeah I think that's really really cool it's like that's such an all-time classic movie like there's always so many good vibes there but um I think Ireland in general has so many cool scenic locations to record and then like I know like other countries have nice land and views but i think ireland has like all those kind of like old ruins and churches and castles and just bits and bobs like a kind of either mystical energy because of like the vikings and you know all different things that happened in ireland but i don't know where i'm walking to right now but i'm walking somewhere and i'm going to stay safe because i don't want to get knocked down but um Ireland. I've never visited Ireland. Yeah, you definitely should. Got loads of cheap lights. I just put my hat on, you know. Gotta protect the quiff. I think my eyes look a bit mad, but is that a VOCA? No, it's not a VOCA. It's a secret location. Yes, what's up? We're walking. Um, do you remember coming to 
Blanavin. Yes, I remember coming to Blanavin. We recorded um, recorded TV show there. I'm going to cross the road to get into the shade. I'm hearing a lot of kids. There must be a school nearby. There could, must be something. But, um... Hi, everyone. You are brilliant, Edward. Thank you. Yeah, Wales is definitely a vibe. Oh, my God. Guess what? There was this castle fort for sale in Wales off the coast. And it had a bridge that went out to it. And I think it was like 80,000 euro. I know it's still a lot of money. But for what this was, oh, my God. It was, like, incredible. And me and John were like, we should definitely, like, live there. And, like, it'd be so cool. Like, I think you can get a ferry from Ireland to there. And um, it would be such a good vibe, like, I swear to God. Just, like, it had, like, it was just, I say it nearly cost a few million to make. The amount of stone, limestone in it, I don't know if it's still for sale, but then it's meant to be, like, a natural heritage thing. So I kind of felt like if we bought it, people in the local area might be like, oh, Jedward, who do they think they are buying this? But um, I definitely think it would have been a cool moment. And I don't know if I've told everyone this, but I remember there was a, a, an island for sale off Cork. And like, it was like, I think like 90,000, it's still a lot of money, but like it was, it was this lighthouse and I was going to have like an RT show. I was thinking of buying it and then making an RT show on like all the locals and we all like get together to make like a cool, like restore it all. And then there was another thing, a monastery, what was it No, there was a convent for sale in the middle of Ireland and it was like 15,000 square feet and... I was going to, it was 60,000. It was huge. It had its own church. And I was like, oh my God, we could do gigs in this, in this monastery or like this convent. And that it had like rooms and everything. We could have had a Jedward HQ. And um, it was just so good. Like, and then I was thinking of getting like all the nuns in Ireland and find Ireland's most holy. And like get them to use iPads, to use like the guitar, do like a TV show. And then I was also going to store all our clothes there because at the time I had like five storage units of clothes, which would cost a lot of money to have storage, still do. And then um, like just imagine having this convent. And then like I went to see this place on the Friday and it sold on Saturday and then on Monday contacted and they were like oh no sorry it's gone but like I still to this day are just like Jesus I could have had this beautiful like it had like triple glazed windows they'd totally done it open had this beautiful stairs it was like something you'd see out of a movie like I have like Artemis Fowl or Harry Potter and it just it was just a vibe like the windows were huge like it would have been such a good getaway for the summer and then I, I remember there was another house for sale down in Ireland and the guy from Harry Potter, I don't know his name, some other guy, but he was there at the showing. And I was like, there's no chance we're getting this. And it had its own river. It had like, it was such a vibe. But um, like these houses were not, didn't really have that much around them, but they were kind of just like a place where you can make your own videos, do whatever you want to do and have your own space. But like, I just love seeing good deals. Like I love going on um, like Daft or going on property websites and seeing all these cool, house you can get in like different unusual locations but um you know like there's always so many I'd, I'd love to get something that's a bit different but um I'm sorry for the random conversation but it, 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 I don't have what's for the conversation I don't know what's going on but I'm after coming across a leaf which is shaped like a smiley face like look at that smiley face guys anyway Anyway, um, I hope you're all doing good. And for everyone who stayed in this, someone goes, my whole house in Mayo was up for like 80,000. Wish I could have bought it. Aw. Yeah, I know there's so many great places around Ireland. And it's crazy when you come to Dublin, like a one bedroom apartment, it's only 500,000. Or you could get like, I don't know if house has gone up, they've gone up loads. But like, you used to be able to get like, absolutely incredible, places but um i feel like <laughs> i feel like we can make the jared hotel but um who knows what the future holds 
And I sometimes I feel like you don't need you don't need all these things in your life. As long as you're able to do your live your life and do what you gotta do, you don't need so much things. Like you're not defined by what you have. Okay. Yeah, we're by ourselves. But um I think my nose is getting red. Yeah, houses have gone up. I feel like just um just look after yourselves and my nose is really red, but like don't put yourself under pressure. Like I feel like we're nearly thirsty and we still don't have everything together, but we're still doing our thing, still living for the magic. Um, and then like, I had a vision. I was going to buy some land and then maybe put a glass box in the middle of it and just write songs and just vibe there. Like sometimes I feel like it's more like a location. If you got somewhere that makes you feel peaceful or zen, that'd be such a vibe. Oh. I don't know if I said this on another live, but there was four acres for sale just outside of Dublin near Rush and Scaries and it was like 60,000 and I was like oh my god we need to get this and have like Jebbard festivals and there was a bus stop outside it as well and it had its own little mini beach and um, it had planning permission to build a house but you had to be like a farmer or something or but I think we could have got the plan permission but at the time I was just like this would be so good to do like little Jebbard festivals and like in Ireland, you need a permit for when it goes over 5,000. But then I was like, I'd be happy if there was even 200 people there or 100, whatever. And like, it would be like this little retreat. But um, now it's gone, but I still think it's an option. Like, it'd be so cool. And um, it had its own little beach. And um, it had a little river going to it as well. But it was like so all over the place. But I just liked that it was all just random. And I just had all these different visions of this, all these different things happening. But um, anyway, who knows what the future holds, guys. It's all about getting the album. Um, you know, hi, everyone who's still here. You're all legends. Who's still watching? Who's her? Who's with us? Maria, Sherry, Naomi. Hello, Samuel Ross. Helen's still here. Chesney Dowling, hello. Hello, Michelle Brown. Hello, Shauna Myler. Hello, Shell. Hey, Connie. Oh, Connie. Hi, Connie. Haven't seen you in a while. It's been a while. So weird. Like, there's two people walking, so I'm going to stay quiet. Okay, we're back. Um, oh, thank you, Heather Mars. She said she's been here from the start. Heather, I hope you're wrapping your dancing, doing your thing. Oh, hi, Nicola. Oh, I found a nice little wall. We're vibing with the wall. Okay, we're still going. Hopefully the signal is the signal good. I think the signal is good, is it? Oh, watch it for my bed. Oh, you got COVID um side effects from the jab or whatever it's called. It's so weird. Everyone in the UK's got their um vaccines and here no one's got any. Like it's only like much older people. It's all good. I'm seeing a river. I'm hearing a river. But thanks for all joining me on this walk. I really appreciate that. Very appreciate that. Oh my God. I love when it gets to this lighting, but then when it gets to the hardcore sun, Jesus, God bless me. Okay, how are the white shoes doing? They're still okay. Okay. I just going on random adventures. Anyway, um, how are we all doing? Do, 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 do. I appreciate you. Thanks. Who else is on here? Hi, everyone. Okay. Loads of questions. Have you put your sun cream on your Irish skin? Yes, I have. Um, could you guys come on our podcast? I don't know. Um, you're, you're a dilf. What? Um, hi, Jared. What's your star sign? Um, my star sign is Libra. Um, 
How are you? I'm doing pretty good. What do you want to achieve this year? Well, I'd love to get our next album out. Um, do you like jellyfish? I do not like jellyfish. I think when I was younger, I got stung by a few jellyfish. What's my favorite biscuit? Um, I think Mikado's, the one with the marshmallows and the jam. Um, thoughts on the leaving search? Um, very, very hard, very difficult. You're all heroes. Um, I'm still walking. I love these houses that are just old and have so much character. Like I always have visions of buying a house or whatever, and then you discover all these bits and bobs. Or you find like, you know, like the, there's a person in, the, in America and they bought Marilyn Monroe's house and they literally find bits and bobs belonging to her in the attic. Um, to everyone else watching this, we're putting a clip up of one of our songs called Treat Me Like a Human on Instagram today. So hopefully you guys feel the vibes and imagine yourself at a concert having a good time. If you come to Sweden and need a car ride, Therese, 100%. I'd rather we zoom around with you having a good time. Um, I love old house, but they also make me think of ghosts. Oh my God, you're so right. But like, let's not worry about it. I think ghosts could be anywhere. Um, how do you feel? I'm feeling okay. Oh my God, we're gonna to get to a real busy street now. But um, I wanna send everyone love, support and good energy. Hopefully you're vibing. Okay, I'm gonna find these other steps, a secret location. Some of that littering. Okay, I'm gonna go up here. A new set of steps to heaven. Will we make it to heaven? Yes, we will, because we're so beautiful and religious. It's so hard, gotta do the stretches again. Oh. Yes. Oh. Okay, we're getting up these steps, guys. Where's it gonna lead? We do not know. Making my way downtown, watching fast faces pass, and I'm homebound. And I need you. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, we're vibing. I feel like I'm in Carnation Street on the back streets with that Chesney. Anyway, look at these vibes. Beautiful vibes and energy. I'm Edward Grimes coming live from Ireland. Um, hi everyone. Oh, I just fell, kind of hurt my ankle. Um, anyway, I hope we're all staying safe and looking after ourselves. Um, such a nice location. Yes, 100%. This is really happening. Feeling my vibes, feeling my vibes, feeling my vibes. Get low, get low, get low. Yeah. Anyway, guys, we could be here all day, but um, hey. Someone said they're going to a local farm to buy eggs. Just remembered, I got boring college tomorrow. No, Megan, it's not boring, you're a legend. Anyway, I'm finding some nice grass to roll around in. Is 
Is everyone still here? Yeah. We're all still here. Oh my god, I just saw a bird. Anyway, I'm gonna lie in the grass and just be. Hopefully, there's no dog poo anywhere. Okay. Mm. Oh my god, the sun is insane. I can't even see. Hello? Mm. Guys, look at that nice sky. Beautiful sky. Walk in the sky. Walk in the sky. Oh, yes. Walk, walk. Do, 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 Anyway. Um, look at those nice daisies. We're back to the daisy situation, guys. Anyway. Okay. I feel like the sun's gone in, so that's good. Mm, so really bright, anyway. I'm just gonna find. Mm. I can't even open up. I feel like a newborn baby trying to open their eyes. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Hello? No, not happening. Sun, please give me a break. I'm gonna go this way. Um, can you sing Ed Sheeran? Go on to our Afterglow cover that we did. It's on IGTV. Oh my God, the sun's coming back. The cloud. No, don't come back. You're burning me. Okay, okay maybe this side, maybe. Oh, this is good. Um, don't fall asleep. No, I will not fall asleep. Um, anyway. Hope we're all good. Um, I wish I knew what I was doing, but I don't. Anyway, um, oh look at that nice filter, it gives me like blue eyes, Jesus, I look beautiful. This is too, it's kind of vibey. Jesus, what is that doing? Yes, the hair is growing back. Okay. Um Arma, hello Arma. Hey everyone. Anyway, I hope you're loving the vibes. I hope you got some outdoor vibes with me today. And we're just chilling. It's getting really blurry. Hello? We're also here, aren't we? Some of these filters. Hello. Yes, these are the five I need. Okay. Old school filter. Hey everyone. Does that work? Okay. Get back on our walk. Oh, okay, we're still vibing. So rocking it, guys. Look at these, look at all these daisies, it's actually crazy. 
Like, there's loads. Okay. <laughs> Guy watering his lands. He's out washing them. everyone hope you're all doing good i love seeing like those elderly couples and they're just so in love they're always just vibing looking after each other <laughs> yeah the spring is definitely coming all the daffodils such a pretty hard face yes Okay, um, I feel like I need to say goodbye to everyone, but um, everyone look after themselves, make sure to comment, and share, everything's epic, love you, I love you.